Alright, so once again, good evening, dear students from around the globe. My name is Teacher Brian. I'm an educator from the Philippines. And for tonight's session, Volume 87 of the Online Global Classroom, we're going to talk about the 21st century skills. So for tonight, I have students from India, from Japan, and of course, from the Philippines. So let's start by you introducing yourself, okay? Let's start first with Sanskriti from India. Can you introduce yourself, please? Thank you so much, sir. Hello, everyone. My name is Sanskriti Chahan, and I am from India. My facilitator is Ms. Jyoti Vashya. So I'm 13 years old and currently studying in ninth grade. Wonderful. Thank you so much, Sanskriti. And yeah. now, Let's go with our students from Japan. So let's start with me, Ishikawa. Yes. Um, my name is Mei Ishikawa, and I'm I'm a Japanese student, and I'm seventh. Uh, no, I'm first grade in high school. Uh, nice to meet you. Thank you. You're more welcome. Okay, thank you, May. Now let's have I, Oiwa. Hi. Uh, my name is I, Oiwa. Uh, I'm Japanese high school student. So, uh, um I I can't speak English well. So I um, uh, that's all thank you. <laughs> no problem, no problem. Hi, you can also use the chat, okay? Students, if you're having problem in speaking, you could type your answers, okay? That's fine with me. And uh, again, thank you, I from Japan. And let's have the students from the Philippines. Let's have first Arisa, please. Hello. Good evening, everyone. My name is Princess Arisa, and I'm a student in the Philippines. I, um, I am currently a first-year college student taking up Bachelor of Elementary Education uh, in a state university here in the Philippines. So nice to meet you all. Thank you so much, Ms. Raisa. And let's have Kim, another student from the Philippines. Hello, my name is Kim Nicole Pivillanera from Philippines, and I'm 19 years old. I'm also a, co a college student. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Ms. Kim. Okay. And the uh, students from India and Japan, they are the two Filipino students, are my students. Okay. So, uh, you don't have to worry, okay? We'll ask them difficult questions. <laughs> All right, so uh, let's get started, okay? So we have five questions here, okay? Uh, let's begin with Sanskriti, okay? Uh, Sanskriti, would you like to answer all the five questions or do you have a presentation to share? I'd like to answer all the questions, sir. All right, go ahead. So we would like to hear your ideas and your answers into this question you may start sure thank you so much so we go with the first question explain 24th century skills so we are blessed to live in the 24th century because as compared to the earlier centuries life was very easy comfortable and peaceful as per their aspect so our life has become easy due to the inventions of various gadgets we should be thankful to all the known or unknown inventors who still provide us such an easy, safe and peaceful life in our century. This century will be for the people who have developed some skills. Only production of goods and their distribution could not save the world economically. But the survival and the skills will save the world. According to me, this century's biggest skill is artificial intelligence. So next question we goes that why do we need them? 
So this skill is of creating gadget uh, which can think by themselves according to the situation and save millions of lives. The use of the technology we find in every aspect of our life, deals in emergency situations, deals in dangerous areas, road assistance, helping old age people. These skills of people help the world to develop faster and provide the safe environment of working to them. Example, building Sophia AI robot by Singapore for UAE. Sophia can take place of teachers, debater, counselor or many other activities. It's not only to save our time, money as well as it works. The skill to develop AI among students must be there. It can change the world very fastly. This century will be only of the skillful people. According to me, skill of having knowledge of AI is the biggest skill ever. So next question that is there any out of date skill? So according to me, any skill cannot be out of date because skill has enhanced your capacity to, uh, to stand out out of the common people. Any skill that increase our value economically. So if you learn or developing any skill doesn't mean it's a waste of money or time. But we found due to the invention of some gadgets like computer printer, the skill of the painting on canvas have somewhat become old or outdated. But some of the painters, sketchers modified their skills and started drawing on computer screen, which has changed the world for the painters. VFX technology has provided some of what a new life to the painter, sketch, or the thinkers, which we can see in the films. So no skill is ever out of date. So fourth question is, how has your teacher taught them to you? So yes, a very big yes. Our AI teacher teaches us how to work AI and how we can learn AI programming. Our teachers' experiences and our creations can do lots of wonders. It depends how we can, how much we learn from our teachers and how they guide us to the path. But we have to create it by our own creativity, knowledge. Our teachers guide us and we should follow the guidance to achieve the aim. Last questions we go, are there critical to be learned to be successful? So quite true, I have already told that if you want to be successful in the century, we must be uh, skillful. So parents should te uh, teach their children some skills from the very beginning and it may introduce them to the uh, hobby and later then allow them to learn or choose them as a career. But at the end, only theoretical learning cannot be enough to survive. So depending on this development of the skills are very needed in the century. Thank you so much for giving me a chance. Thank you. Wonderful. That's really, um, how, how should I state Sanskrit? That was really fantastic. Okay. Um, Thank you. I, I love how you explain the out-of-date skills. You you didn't say that there's, um, how, how should I say it? You didn't emphasize that there is an outdated skill. So you just need to, you know, improve yourself. And the last question, when you answered, are they critical to learn to be successful? You, you somehow explain it in a perspective of a learner who wish to improve yourself in your own way or in your own techniques. Okay? And it shows that there is no critical thing that, you know, that you will be doing if you love or if you enjoy what you're doing. That's perfect. Wonderful, wonderful. I, I'm i sure uh, Miss Gioti is really proud of you. <laughs> I suppose you're one of her star students, right? Thank you. All right, you're much more welcome. Oh, by the way, students, uh, we have here uh, Teacher MC, another educator from the Philippines. Good evening, teacher. Hi, good evening. All right. So, um, Go on, sir. <laughs> so let's have uh, students from Japan. Let's hear their answers to this five wonderful questions. Let's start with May. Ishikawa, May? Yes. Okay, first of all, explain 21st century skills. My answer is I would like um I would like to talk about Japanese science and technology as a, as an example robot develop, robot 
development is more advanced than ever to support our lives. For example, I feel I recently I feel that the examines exam exist <laughs> sorry <laughs> existence of robots is prohibited around the oper operation in Japan such as um among the frozen frozen food storage and hotel inspections desk desk um, second why do we need them because in Japan because in Japan the degrees degrees pass rate and every population is increasing so number of people who can work in decreasing so I feel these robot science technology skills are necessary for us um, next is there any out of date skill I think it's actually generated by nuclear power in Japan 2011 greatest Japan earthquake there was a greatest Japan earthquake uh, sorry was happened as a result I hear that there are still people who can't return their home and people who pass away by nuclear power. So I think we should promote solar power skill because in Japan there were many earthquakes. So it is necessary to promote skills to um sorry um Either because there are many aspects in Japan, so it is necessary to promote skill without visual damage, human and and their lives. And next question: How has your teacher taught them to you? Them to us? I think they are not. They have some teachers. So I research on the internet about these information. Finally, are they are they critical to learn to be successful? Um, yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know how to say. <laughs> uh, I think this technology has been development according to the time and situation so I think yeah I think they are necessary <laughs> necessary sorry that's all thank you so much you're welcome that that's really wonderful answer okay when you explain the 21st century skill in japan mostly robots of course japan is number one when it comes to technology we, who would not agree with your answer right and um your answer to number four that is also great because if our teacher okay or your educators sometimes forgot to tell you or to teach you those things you can always research just like what you did that's really fantastic and your answer to the last question that was really great okay um 21st century skills are really necessary okay it is needed okay we need to follow 
what's happening in our surrounding, but not forgetting, you know, the importance of those things as well in life. Wonderful, really wonderful. Okay, now um, let's hear from uh, I. I will. Hi. Thank you once again, May. question explain 21st century skills so I think it is the power to create a happy future for your health and yourself so uh, Question. So, I think we need the power to send up to people's hearts. This is because in occupations such as doctors, counselors, school teachers, uh, where human interaction is essential, it is necessary to be close to people's hearts, but I don't think computer can do it. So, third question, uh, I don't know what, what to say, sorry. Uh, yeah, uh, Next question, has your teacher taught them to you? Uh, maybe he's not. Uh, but he said it is important for us to live in the future. So, finally, uh, are there uh, are they critical to learn to be successful? So, uh, for a happy future, I think we need to learn more about the, uh, sorry, more about things that computers cannot do. Yeah, that's all. Thank you. No worries. Thank you as well, Ai. Um, what I I remember with your responses is that when you said 21st century skill, uh, happy uh, happy future, of course, okay, we are looking forward to have a better future. That is why we need to accept it, okay? Just like when you answer number four, your teacher taught you or told you that in order for you to have a happy future, you need to accept okay or you need to learn 21st century skill um that is something new okay to my ear when it comes to 21st century skill is that if you accept it you'll have a happy future i guess that is also possible okay so thank you thank you wonderful thank answer. You. Bye. um teacher mc would you like to ask the filipino students perhaps Yeah, sure. Hi, uh, good evening everyone. Uh, nice to see you once again. Uh, may I ask uh, first, let's have Princess. Princess, uh, would you like to share to us your key takeaways about the importance of 21st century school? I have researched about this and uh, I've noticed uh, uh, for all the sites that I've checked, uh, there's one thing that's the same. Uh, they, uh, it was stated there that uh, 21st century skills are necessary or are nece necessities in order for a person to become successful or to survive uh, the changes uh, that occurs or that appears 
in the world. So that's the main key takeaway that I've uh, learned. Yeah, yeah that's, that's a very good observation. Uh, remembering that the 21st century skills are necessary to survive our ever-changing world. Now, may, may I have a follow-up question for you, Princess? Regarding attaining the, the skills, what are some things that you have discovered about ways to learn, perhaps, the 21st century skills? How can one equip oneself of the 21st century skills? Uh, okay, first, uh, I think uh, attending schools or teachers, facilitators, uh, uh, has really a big uh, contribution on how students can learn the 21st century skills. Like, for example, communication. Uh, communication can be developed through uh, exchanging conversations inside the classroom or when the teachers ask a student to answer this specific question. And like for example, another one is the computer literacy. Uh, computer li literacy cannot be uh, cannot always be taught to us by our parents because uh, they are not from the 21st century and they are used to the old uh, or the traditional skills. So. Uh, computer literacy is one of the uh, things or the 21st century skills that is being taught inside the school. So it is really a big help, especially for uh, those uh, millennials or those who belong to the Generation Z, because uh, it is really a necessity for us to learn how to use uh, the internet or uh, the technologies that are being uh, innovated or that uh, has been invented uh, in this day. Very interesting answer, Princess. Uh, thank you so much. It's, it's very important, everyone, to remember what the Princess said. Uh, going to school, learning from people who can help you gain the skills. It's, very uh, it's a very important thing in order for one to successfully attain the skills. But of course, aside from that, remember that you have to do it yourself, okay? Uh, Although, for our parents, princess, maybe they are still part of the 21st century. They were not born, yes, uh, from the 21st century, but most probably they would understand. That's why you are being sent by your parents to school because they know that education is needed for every one of you to survive the ever-changing world. Okay, thank you so much, princess. That's wonderful. Very good, huh? And let's have him. So, uh, Kim, what's your key takeaway about the 21st century skill? Particularly, what skill do you think is the most important to learn? Uh, uh, I think your audio is out. Yeah, can you check again? Sir, Teacher MC uh, was asking Kim po. Oh, it, it was Kim, Kim, sorry. Yes, yes. Sorry, thank you. Kim, go ahead, please. Uh, we cannot hear you, Kim. Can you check again? Uh, can you check your audio, Kim? Hello everyone, we have seven minutes left. Go back okay, to the uh, well, seven minutes. Make sure. uh, I would like to ask anyone, please. Um, can you share to us uh, the, the most important skill that you think you as a student should learn? Anyone? Uh, may I hear from... Uh, may I hear from Sanskriti? What do you think is the most important skill that you should learn? Can you hear us? As uh, our student from India. Okay, okay. 
is having uh, about, she's having problem. Yes. So, uh, how about the other students? Kim, uh, have you fixed your audio? Your microphone, perhaps? Ah, here. Okay. So, our uh, Kim here has answered and, and can you fix your audio? No. We can hear you now. Louder, please. Okay, so as I said here, um, for me, the 21st century skills refer to the knowledge that all students need in order to achieve the student learning outcomes associated with the qualities of liberally educated person, or these are the skills that we need in, in the age of internet. First is the learning skills. This is how we adapt to our uh, environment. And the next is the literary skills. This is how our understanding were tested. That's, that's it, sir. Okay, so thank you. Two things that uh, were mentioned by uh, Kim, the learning skills that would help us adapt to our environment. When you say adapt, make us um, survive in the environment that we are in. And also the second one is the literary skills that would help us understand. Uh, yeah, and this is how our understanding is tested. So these, oh, of, of the learning skills, anyone, of the learning skills that you know, which one is the most important then? Because the, the the question of identifying what is the important skill is also making us realize that we have to prioritize some skills. Meaning we have to develop some skills that are useful. Perhaps Peter Bryant has already mentioned that some of these skills have evolved. Some of the skills are considered outdated already. So it means that there were skills that were prioritized by people in order to successfully survive the 21st century. Um, right now, we have computer. We're not anymore sending uh, letters just for us to uh, read a letter at that. Not most of us would do that. Instead of sending written letters, we can communicate via the internet through um, these kinds of things like the Zoom uh, app. So there are skills that we have to learn related to that, right? So Princess, would you like to enlighten us about uh, what you have realized? Uh, teacher, I think the most important uh, uh, 21st century skill for me is critical thinking. Because I think uh, uh those uh who uh those that those skills that uh i didn't mention uh, are already uh, uh they already belong to the critical thinking skill like uh when you are when create i love it i love it having a enjoy a lot it's always, always. A lot, uh, all right, uh, let's go to the uh, Rondo Picker. <laughs> mommy, we oh, don't even pass you bow. What did you say, Mommy? <laughs> mommy, we really don't pass you bow. <laughs> That's so funny. Okay, guys, uh, from tonight, um, about the student's presentation as a representative. All the educators got to the chance to question, okay? Ask any small question of you, okay? Because the last time I was asking the students, hey, what is your future dream? And maybe the educator also asked the uh, representatives, okay? Anyway, let's go quick spin. Seven.
breakout room 7. It's my breakout room. Hi, Tiffany. Let's go. Yes.、Uh, may I invite Justin to say something? Justin, all right, got it. Justin, raise your hand. Justin from the Philippines. Justin from Philippines. Justin, three, two, one. No, Justin. <laughs> Tiffany, no, no Justin. Yes, she has been there. And how about Annie from Armenia? Armenia. Annie from Armenia. Three, Hi, two. Oh, here we go. <laughs> here we go. Yes, hi everyone. Over、I'm、to、sorry. you, Annie. What is the most important 21st century skills?、Uh, the most important、uh, thing, the 21st century, is it is,、uh, I think that the、uh, 21st century is the equipment century.、Mm. And there are many important things. Uh, for example, a technology is very important, significant.、Uh, people can、uh, do by technology everything. They、uh, work or they、uh, call something,、uh, someone.、Uh, I think it is the most important, and uh, it uh, makes easier people's life today. Uh, they uh, can uh, uh, also see.、Uh, They are、uh, friends or family member if they are far from.、Uh, there are many inter-、uh, significant and important things, but in my opinion, the most significant、uh, thing s it is technology today. Very sad. Very sad. Thank you, Ali. And、uh, do you have any <laughs> questions from educators? Anyone? Well, how about... do, you like,、uh, do you know about uh, artificial, uh, artificial intelligence? Any? Okay, so、uh, Jyoti, ask、yeah. you, Ani, Ani, open the camera. Do you know about anyone who knows about artificial intelligence? What is the role of artificial intelligence in our life? Okay, the question is what is the role of the、uh, artificial intelligence? What is the role of the AI in a society? Yeah, should we have this thing or is outdated or,、uh, you know, life of future? All right,、uh, Ani. That's a pretty difficult question, I know. More of the.、Uh, Those、okay, j o t i j o t i I know j o t i j o t i is a drunken now, so I know that is why they ask. She just asked. Hey, um, anyone? Can you answer、uh, j o t i s question? The role of the、uh, AI? Ani represents a wonderful presentation. Yeah. And then. Anyone can answer. Those who know from India, from Indonesia, they can ask. Artificial okay, Jody. Yeah. Jody. Okay. And <laughs> Jody, I just make you mute. Anyone? One question, one answer. Yes. Okay, here we go. So, artificial intelligence basically helps to、uh, bring connections between humans and、uh, the technology, like、uh, the personalized. Texting, whatever you're gonna test, it,、uh, it will assemble your textings, and then further, when you're gonna text again, it will show some resemblance or something like that, and even、uh, converting things in your personal language or the Instagram feed when it gets personalized. So, it's basically the role of artificial intelligence.、Mm, that's maybe if you want to talk about the evidence based <laughs> policy making. I guess, like automatic、uh, EBPM, I guess.、Mm, that's interesting. All right, everybody, let's move on to the next representer.、Uh, wait a minute. Go. Ready to go.
13. Thirteen. No facilitator. No, I, I just telling yeah, you. Elena, you Elena, Elena would be. Yeah, Elena, can you hear me? Alisa. Uh, no, we were in. She wasn't. Oh, group. okay. We group Move on to the next. Thank you so much, guys. Eight. Eight. Okay, it's my room. Okay, great. Okay. <laughs> okay, I would like to invite Lakshita from India to sum up our discussion in our breakout room. Mm. Lakshita? Yes, ma'am. Rashita. Okay. Uh, Mr. Kohi, Mr. Kohi, sorry to disturb you. Oh, uh, Jory, are you so can talkative? We, huh? Yeah, can we wish Lakshita uh, she's birthday today and she was upset, uh, very upset early in the morning. Why? I don't know, just ask. Uh, today is her birthday. Got it. Uh, Rakshita, you were really upset in this morning. What happened to you? Actually, I didn't score well in these midterm examinations. I was upset. Oh, examination? Huh? Oh. Examination? But today, yeah, but today, I think she's she's all right in the evening after she joined the global education classroom. <laughs> global classroom, yeah. Oh, okay. So, yeah, she feel, it seems she feel happy now. Okay, great. Back to the normal. Yeah. Over to you. Like a so step? Yeah. Yes. You can you can start now. So today we discussed about the 21st century skills and uh, our teacher, which is from Taiwan, Mrs. What Claire? Claire. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Claire. We and some students of. Uh, India and also Taiwan discussed about the 21st century skills, the importance of them and what are the out of day skills. We also asked the, some questions which I preferred to be asked, which were preferred to be asked, I think. And yeah, I really learned a lot from this global classroom today. So yeah, it was my experience. Right, now you have it. Yeah, I got, got a good opportunity on my birthday. I think it's a gift for me. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. Uh, any educator, students, do you have any question uh, to the register? Can I move on? Good. Okay. Let's go on the next. Here we go. Number nine. Here we go. Nine. Facilitator. No. Okay. Move on to the next. E Twelve. Twelve. Here we go. Uh, yes, uh, in my group, I have students from Philippines, from India, and from Argentina. Um, it's a difficult test because they all my students are great. Mm -hmm. But let me go to my Tiki Dam. Please, can you sum up? Who is it? Nikita, Nikita, Nikita. Nikita, Nikita raise a hand. Nikita. Oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's a standing one. Okay. Here we go. Greetings everyone here. Nikita, can you bore you up? Greetings everyone. Good. 
so today's experience was very good because i got a great opportunity to collaborate with many other students of the world and i had a great experience in my breakout room because we discussed about many skills of 21st century and what is their importance in our daily life and even is it good for us or bad for us or medical health and many more we also talked about that is that taught in our school or not no thank you so much and that's all right yes and also we uh, try to find out if there are any kind of skills mm. that we don't have until we like to have because we have to be adapted to these in the 21st century students mm-hmm. right thanks for sharing all right let's move on to the next one here we go Number five. Here we go. Five. Facilitator. No facilitator. Hello, everyone. I'm assigned to discuss the session. Okay. Um. Okay. I have. First of all, I am ed- audible. Uh, Teresha, who's your yeah. facilitator tonight? Oh, wait, let me check. Yeah, we are talking to the facilitator number, number five. I think okay. it's Teacher Nirmala. Oh, oh Nirmala, okay, yeah, I got it. So, oh, oh. Thank you. Clear, clear, good, clear. All right, over to you, uh, Teresha, go ahead. She assigned me to summarize the discussion. So, sure, thanks. Okay, I am Vishayan Kilgo, and I would like to greet all of you. A good evening, all the way from the Philippines. Good evening. And hello. So, in our meeting, um, we have a very interactive session, and we discuss about the given set of questions. Um, we share about we share about the insights about our feelings and feelings about our schools and as well uh, our education so and even though we are from different countries um the ideas in the questions are much likely the same so we discuss how 21st century skills help us today uh, as a teacher and as a student and in my own understanding upon the discussion um in my own perception, uh, as a college student, it is very much uh, important to develop and discover those 21st century skills that we mentioned to make our lives much easier and you know easy to understand. I think that's all. Thank you very mm, much. It's beautiful. Thank you so much for uh, presenting your ideas. Do you have any questions, educators and students? All right, we have mention teacher Cohen, but like oh, sure, Alisa, uh, here we go. I would like in order not to give everyone just uh just the one question just to describe twenty first century student, but let it be like a wrap up question, <laughs> not in the middle one. Okay. Just in the chat, just to type one word that describes a twenty first century student. Interesting, interesting. Let's go. Guys, please chat. Uh, what is the significant skills among a twenty-first century skills? Uh, just one word. Should not. Maybe it should be your adjective, Alisa. No, doesn't matter. Yes. Okay. Oh, some of them. Ah, uh, flexible progress technology. Okay, let's go, guys. Please chat. Type your. <laughs> oh, sees. <laughs> oh, why? Yeah. Oh, sees. Okay. Please chat. 
everyone, soft skills, critical thinkers, creative communication. So any skills will be okay. Choose your one significant skills. Nina from Japan, what do you think, Nina? Please just chat.、Uh, Okay, critical thinking.、Uh, globally aware, innovation, create.、Mm, good. Kiro, what do you think? Have you typed it? Think about it.、Uh-huh. Roger, 21st century. Maybe taking a list. <laughs> 21st century because of、uh, busy world and competitive worlds. Always busy. We need a rest. Work life balance. Work life balance.、Mm. Social emotional learning. Social, social emotional. Yeah, that's some new skill I learned after pandemic. It's more than important than the technology.、Teachers. Yeah. Life skills. <laughs> Okay. Sustainability, communication, l a b Hmm, these are no gaming skills. I'm not、Minecraft. joking, okay? Gaming, gaming skills I, are also. I know,、good. right? Oh, yes. We have gaming skills too. Yeah. Call of Duty. Live stream skill. Virtual、uh, persistence. Okay, good. Good. In my master course,、uh, American education,、um, they aim to make students be resilient s t u d e n t resilient. Because South Korea and also the papers say Chinese education, they successfully make students be resilient.、Mm. But unfortunately, in Japan, Japanese students are not resilient, they say. Come on, we are resilient. <laughs> I'm resilient, come on. <laughs> okay, thank you. In Asia, we are more westernized already. Oh, westernized. I know. I'm going to show you the PowerPoint, my slide for my master assignment. Thanks, everybody. Okay, great. And now, changing the world. We need to think about it and what is the meaning of communication, like a true meaning, and also what is the true meaning of collaboration and creativity, too. Okay? okay, continue to think about it and also find out the right answer. Okay, through the、uh, your teacher's lesson or some global、uh, classroom or connection、uh, project. Guys, okay. Thanks for joining in again, and let me make this some great feedback video again. See you next Saturday. Bye bye. Thank you so much, everyone. Cheers. Bye-bye. Cheers. Bye-bye. 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 Cheers. Bye. 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 B